John Luke. Hey. John Luke. John Luke. What? Crush it. Willie. Crush it! Willie. Oh. Willie, no coaching from the stands. You're distracting. I'm not distracting them. John Luke's hair looks cute like that, doesn't it? Come on it. Yeah, I kind of wanted to get it cut for the wedding. Well, you don't like long hair on a guy? If he keeps growing it, it's going to be like as long it's, as mine. It is. So it's true. That'll be awkward. It's not awkward. Put some spit on it. Sometimes it's awkward and your hair is like as long as mine. You could wear a bandana. Yeah. Look at my dad. Yeah. Look at me. Look at John Luke. Oh, my. Good job, buddy. John Luke, grunt more. Dad, I'm trying to play. You need to grunt. Willie, you talk when the point's over with. Oh, OK. I told you, babe. You're going to kick us out. Me out of here. All right, I can be a little vocal when it comes to John Luke's sporting events. But one of my basic duties as a father is coaching my son. Come on, John Luke. What? Crush it. You're not the coach. Crush. Dad. Crush. Dad. Crush it. Oh, Willie. Saying nothing at all during my son's match, there's a word for that. It's called neglect. Willie. I'm not saying anything. Sit down. Crush it. Willie, just sit down. So the way I see it, I'm just being a good parent. All right, John Luke, this is match point right here. Right, match point, big point, big point. Oh, oh, she got this. I don't know if he does or not. There you go. Mom. Crush! Oh, nice. Good shot. There you go. Good That's what I'm talking about. Good work. Good work, guys. Good good. Good game. Look good out there. Crush it next time. He won. Or anybody can beat them. Crap. Oh, God. It's who you're playing against. When your mom and I used to play. When's the last time y'all played? She, we played like. Oh. We play all the time. We, we should, should play together. Yeah, we should play. You got the best in West Monroe right here. Uh, I don't know. We could play doubles. It'd be fun. Yeah, let's play. Every time we do this, you get hurt. That is true. No, I don't. But you do get injured a lot. Professional athletes get hurt every week. So, in a way, I'm kind of like that. Okay. Don't worry about me. All right. Let's do it. Right, do it. Let's do it. Don't Why? make cry whenever I beat you now. You ain't playing against seventh grade boys here. Willie, he won. If you play like that when you play us, you're going to get drilled. Hey, that's a pretty good trophy. It ties the room together. Shouldn't it be gold? Brown. Why did Willie bring this trophy in here? <laughs> he didn't. I, I took it out of his office and brought it in here. He's so? probably going nuts looking for it. That trophy weighs more I than know. you. Hey, you look at that. <laughs> look at his arm shaking. Hey, that's because there's so much power in there. Uh -huh. Hey, I'm That's a bunch you. of horses ready hey, to be hold released. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Look, this is a herd of them, OK? <laughs> waiting to be released. It's a Charlie horse. Hey, no. That ain't not a second. <laughs> not. A solid iron, boys. <laughs> oh, yeah. So you use the dolly? Is that what they call it, see if the thing's got wheels on it? Yeah, it's a dolly. A dolly? Oh, yeah. OK. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> With the annual Duck Commander 500 NASCAR race coming up, some of us are having trouble focusing in the duck call shop. All I want to be is Grand Marshal. I don't think you got what it takes. What are you talking about? No. Yeah. Now, I could care less who really is the Grand Marshal, but Cy thinking he's the most qualified. And I've got it, boys. It's just crazy. The Grand Marshal is a man that has got a lot of, sh what, showmanship? Swag. swag. I've got showmanship and swag. The man is loud enough on his own. The last thing he needs is a live microphone. All I want to do is drive on them things. Me too. One of my buddies is testing today out at the track. Will he let us drive it? Let me see if he's still out there. He ain't going to let you drive it. What are you talking about not letting me drive it? You're one stop away from never having a driver's license <laughs> the rest of your nah. life. I'm fixing to put some of them clowns in the wall. Who took my trophy? Hey, can I be the grand poobah of the race? What? I want to be the grand poobah. Grand poobah? Yeah. I don't even know The grand marshal of the race. Tell me, gentlemen, start your engines. Denied. That's a big mistake. A big fat why is that mistake. A big, why is that a big mistake? What are you talking about mistakes? Look at what you got on. <laughs> Snow I mean, camo shorts. For your information, <laughs> I'm going to play tennis with John Luke and Mary Kate. Oh, you're going to get your tail straight. I'll break something. I want that back in my office. We'll get on that right before we go 
drive an actual race car. Yeah, my buddy's got a car. We might be driving it. In town? Yeah. I'm gonna put somebody in the wall. Count me out on that. All right. Quit getting stuff out of my freaking office. Uh-oh. What happened? Uh-oh. Boom! Ronnie said, come on out, boys. Really? <laughs> Heck, yeah. I'm giving y'all fair warning, boys. Somebody's going to the wall. Crash it! Dad! Yeah. Practice serves. Anytime. Willie. Spread your wings like an eagle. Don't talk in the middle That's of my serve. Little one. You need to turn into an eagle. I've never heard anybody say do eagle. Serving. You've never had a professional lesson. Hey, are we going to play? OK, we're loose. I'm really happy that John Lincoln and Mary Kate decided to play a couple tennis with us, but I'm a little bit concerned that Willie could be taking the competition a little too seriously. Cliff. <laughs> a swing and a miss. John Luke may be used to his dad's competitive spirit. No pressure, Mary Kate. Oh, my gosh. But I think he could actually be scaring Mary Kate. Oh! Like a little mouse coming to the cobra. What is the cobra? It's me coming up behind the net. Willie may think he's teaching them a lesson about marriage and tennis. The cobra, the eagle. That's how you teach. And cobras and eagles. But the only thing they're actually learning is how not to act on a tennis court. And the old people win. Well, another one we've won. Two, zero. All right, I know what y'all are going through. You think it's over, but this is a good lesson. Just like in marriage, you have to stick with it. See, your mom, she's kind of an old tennis player, but we play together as a team, and basically are kicking y'all's butts, and y'all should be embarrassed. You get the lesson? OK, you just said I'm old, and they should be embarrassed. It was a little fuzzy. They should be embarrassed. I said you're an that older tennis player. That is not encouraged. John Luke, do you get the lesson? I got it. Let's play some tennis. Look, just because I'm playing my son as fiance doesn't mean I'm going to take this match lightly. In fact, it's just the opposite. Oh! <laughs> Good job, Mary Kay. I can't think of a better metaphor for the struggles of marriage than getting crushed in a couple's tennis match. Crash it! <laughs> All right, John Lee, we got this. Oh, you don't have this, Mary Kay. I'm doing this out of love. The bigger the beatdown Corey and I serve up, uh oh, go. The more they're gonna have to learn to work as a team and gain the necessary skills for marriage. You just staying in there? Don't hit it to him at the net. Good job. Good night. Skills like communication. You need some oxygen? Maybe we can get you on those tanks. I'm running all over the court. You're just standing up there. Admitting when you're wrong. Nope. How far? Willie. Really? It was out by a mile, Dad. Being supportive. Net. Wow. I think the eagle was sleeping on that one. And complimenting each other's weaknesses. Crap. Oh! Sadie. If you'd actually hit the ball in, she'll stop calling it out. <laughs> Willie. One day, they're going to look back at this butt kicking. That's game. Two to one. And thank me for my coaching, on and off the court. Oh! Oh! Home run. Oh, you all right there, Cobra? Mm, I felt like a Cobra just bit my shoulder. I'm feeling a comeback. Hey, just let me know if you need me to come in for you. Steady, pipe down. This is every redneck dream. Awesome. OK, pit this time. Pit this time. Uh, they shut her down. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. There you go. Uh -oh. OK. You talking about a grand engine. Good. Woo. Nice. Smile, guys. You're on camera. Hey. All my friends are here. Well, I took her loud, ain't it? What? Hey, look, guys, this ain't my first time around high-tech vehicles, all right? I drove a deuce and a half in Vietnam, for crying out loud. All right, guys, before we hit the track, we're going to learn about pit road action. Look, when something broke, hey, we didn't need no fancy pit tools, all right? We were the tools. Couple of pups, and there you go. No, Jack, hey, no problem. Look, that's what these puppies right here were for. Hey, installed. My teeth, they could fit any side lug nut. Tire needed air, they're called lungs. Let's see what you got, go. One, so I'd be careful two, with that. That's loaded. Get on it, you get on it. Get on. Hey, I was so good at it, OK? Hey, my lieutenant, he said I was the biggest tool in the company. Put the gun right, down out and step away. 
Hey, you talking about high praise, boys. We got one more thing we still need to do. We've jacked the car up. We still got to get fuel in the car so we can race. Now, I don't know about car gas, but hey, human gas, this is your boy. He don't look like much. Uh, that's but, right. <laughs> but he's deadly. <laughs> I'm not going to sit here and tell you I'm the best farter in the duck call room, but everybody else will. Jep is now attempting the gas man. What's up? Here, son, here. <laughs> uh -oh. Back off, back off. You got a mask. If we were all X Men, there is no doubt my superpower would be farting on command. Hey! Oh! Yeah, we got about five laps, unfortunately, on the ground here in front of us. So we're cutting into y'all's driving time now. That ain't good, Jeff. What would my superhero name be? The Wind Warrior. Fantastic fart. The Gust of Death. Sloppy Gas Man. Don't mess with me, because it's coming. It's coming. And hell's coming with it. You know, on a regular NASCAR crew team, this would be grounds for getting fired. Better to be fired than on fire. Yeah, fire does happen. Yeah. All right, who wants to drive this thing? I don't yeah. drive hey. on the drive. All right, let's fire this sucker up. Maybe we should move it from the gas. Yeah, we go. Oh, we don't burn we out fun. on that. I hope you guys end up driving a lot better than you yeah. are putting fuel in the car. Some people were born drivers. Some were born to be crappy gas men. Crash it! Oh. All right. The kids made quite a comeback, but the elders still have match point. Game, set, point. Uh. 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 Serve the ball. Uh. Willie may have started this match trying to share some pearls of wisdom with John Luke and Mary Kate. Oh, no. Crap. Oh, shoot. Oh! But now I'm not even sure he's going to make it through the match, let alone teach them anything. Dad looks like he's falling apart. All right, Aaron and Juice. You're not on Dance with the Stars anymore. The only person learning a lesson here is Willie. Oh. Always stretch before physical activity. About to pass out here. You can ice it later. Come on. Uh. Oh. Oh. You got it. Oh. You got it. Yours. Yours. Oh. 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 Look, I may not be able to lift my arm for a week or two, but beating them two youngsters made it all worth it. And it was also nice teaching them about marriage and stuff like that. This is what 23 years of marriage looks like. And if nothing else, they at least learn to enjoy their youth and their healthy rotator cuffs. Trust me, they don't last forever. These shoulders, they run in the family. Excuse me, sir, don't lean on the neck. You just gotta struggle through the pain. It's just like marriage. You gotta, uh, and uh, work as a team. Good game, kids. Two minutes. Two minutes. Uh. All right, guys, this is what we've been waiting for all day, what we've been leading up to. So here's our chance to drive and race the car today. What we're gonna do is we're gonna run three laps, and the winner gets to be the Grand Marshal. Really? Yeah. Oh, I got this. Go for it. Right. 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 I'll this, go first. Swing boys. your right leg in first. Yeah, swing in there and sit down. Oh. It's real easy. Uh-oh. There yeah. you go. There you go. No, that's all of it. He's hung, boys. All right, I'm out. He looked like a race car centaur. All right, Godwin, I guess you're going to be up next. Oh, yeah. Look, race cars are designed to be fast. <laughs> Uh-oh. And when you want to be fast, you got to be light. I can't reach the pedal. Oh, uh -oh. no. <laughs> Can you move that seat up, Tom? <laughs> The seat don't move. And you can't be light when you're the size of a walrus. Jeff, how you feel? I feel strong, boys. He's feel strong. strong. All right, here we go. Get a little pump, a little gas. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right, let's back okay. off here. All right, All right Jeff, good luck. Got Have fun, Jeff. Get two fit to take her around for three, boys. OK, he's out of the clutch. Give it a little gas. Here she goes. That's Whoa. all right. That's all right. All right. All right. Time is ticking. Start the clock. Next. I'm pretty terrified of driving this thing right now. Give us some gas. 
Let it go. Give it some gas. I spilled a lot of gas on myself trying to fill this thing up, especially around my nether regions. Come on, give it a little gas. You're fine. Come on. How are you? This is like the pace car. If I push this thing too hard, it might burst into flames, along with my shorts. All right, coming for the checker. Coming for the checker. Coming for the checker, boy. Coming for the checker flag. Come on by. And I like these shorts, along with what's under them. Your fastest time was a 38.2 seconds. <laughs> 38. I think I can run that. Is that fast? Uh, if you was running a two-and-a-half-mile track, let's say Daytona or Talladega it would be, but uh, no, not on a three-eighths mile. You want to see somebody go fast? Yeah. You need to get right. him. Get him out. All right. Yeah. So Martin and Godwin were disqualified for complications due to size. Ow. Jeb's driving around like he's leading a parade. And Si is probably going to put the car in the wall. So I basically have this wrapped up. OK, you ready to go? Uh, give it a little gas. Come on, Jace. Besides forfeiting, I don't think there's any way that I could not win this race. Hey, put it in the next gear, son. We're going to blow it up. They go to third gear. What? You're in second gear. You need to go to third gear. You're in second gear. What everybody needs to realize, it's not even about being Grand Marshal at all. Ain't about in you are, Jim. I just want to win this race. Right, well, that's a 28 second lap. That's pretty good. He beat you about 10 seconds. That's bad. My earplug fell out and I could do here. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but I realized about. I only had it in second gear. I'm glad you realized that because I was scared to death the motor's fixing to explode. How do you like your chances? You They're looking real good right now. Real good. Si, this is way more scary than you think. All right, I got to go make a pit stop before I run. I gotta go make a pitch stop. He does that when he gets nervous. Jace, what was your time? 28 seconds. I'm not real proud of it. I'm gonna beat that by a minute, son. <laughs> You're going down. Find fourth gear in a hurry. You're going down. And stay alive. You're going down. Everybody's big talk before they take off, man. Uh-oh. Oh. Uh -uh. oh, here we go. Why didn't y'all call me? How'd you even know we were here? Jep sent me a selfie. Surprise. Are you letting Cy si ride this car? Looks like it. You realize he's blind and old as crap. Hey, y'all get the fat boy off the track while I can do my three laps. Good luck, Come si. on, si. I'm next. Last man Robinson, start your engines. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. And he's off. Uh-oh, oh. whoa, 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 whoa. He's in the grass. <laughs> he went in the grass. <laughs> Hey, look, in the racing world, you're always hearing guys saying, hey, I got the need for speed. Hey, I got something even better than that, OK? I got the obligation for acceleration. OK, you're taking the green flag this time by. You boys are in trouble. After I win today, I might as well go join NASCAR and win that one, too. Oh, he's going now. That was a fast lap. The only issue I can see right now is holding my bladder for three hours during the race. You're in fourth. Come on. You're good. You're in fourth gear. Come on. I might have to wear a diaper or use my tea glass in an emergency. Looking good. Come on around. Hey, look, I'm not the only racer that's went the diaper route. Why do you think they call Dale Earnhardt Jr.? It's because he wears a diaper. Looking good. Looking good. Keep on the bottom. Come on. Come on, Sam. Come on. Come on. Come uh -oh. on. What's happening? He's slowing down. Pizza, jump. That, that's all of it. Uh -oh. I think we're out of fuel. I ain't no gas in it. Sorry, you ran out of gas. It, it's a good thing, because I fixed to open this puppy up. <laughs> <laughs> you did great once you got uh, out of the grass. Uh -oh. yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Don't break a rib, Sai. Oh, good 26 great. seconds. Congratulations, Sai. You had the fastest time of the day, man. I'm well, happy and proud you did, of you. Sir. Good job. Does that mean I get to be Grand Marshal? You do? No, this ain't finished, son. I still got to ride in. What are you talking about? We have no gas. You don't have and any I'm... more gas? Hey, no. Well, we were practicing pit stops yeah. earlier today, Willie, and all of our gas is on the ground yeah. over there. Does that make me Grand Pooba? No, 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 no. Yeah, we had a bet, so I won yeah, it. Yeah, Willie. To the victor goes the spoils. Here you go. On the NASCAR circuit, they do it with milk, but... Mm. Oh, God. I can't right. believe y'all ran out of gas. All right, let's get out of here, boys. 
Hey! That's what I'm talking about, boys. standing as Sandy Robertson offers our invocation. Dear God, I just come to you today and I just say thank you so much for getting us all here safely. I pray for the weather to hold off the rain and thank you for this beautiful day. God, please be with all the drivers. Thank you for everything you've given us and let this all be in your name. In your name we pray. Amen. It's easy in life to let your competitive nature get the best of you. Even the best of us get too caught up in the competition to have fun in the moment. Or never get caught up in the moment at all because your idiot brother poured five laps worth of gas on his pants. So while there's something to be said for a hard-fought victory, don't forget to enjoy the moments that make it up, especially the moments before you shred every ligament in your shoulder. Hey, Willie, next year, can I drive one of the cars instead of being the Grand Poopa? Nope. Hey, I'll take that as a maybe. brother poured five laps worth of gas on his pants. So while there's something to be said for a hard-fought victory, don't forget to enjoy the moments that make it up, especially the moments before you shred every ligament in your shoulder. Hey, Willie, next year, can I drive one of the cars instead of being the Grand Poopa? Nope. Hey, I'll take that as a maybe.